here it is. You saw it on sale all week, I bet. It's the $299 Freedom Palmetto State Armory 16-inch AR-15. And I've already owned one of the 16-inch Freedom barrels for over a year now, and it's been fine for me. So this one I couldn't resist, especially when they put it together with the OD green furniture. So the kit has everything except for the stripped lower, and you would also need a magazine and an, a rear iron sight or an optic for it. But, you know, since it does include the bolt carrier group, the charging handle, the stock, the lower parts kit, everything, uh, it's just a fantastic deal. And it was free shipping, no tax. PSA did a nice job getting it out to me pretty quickly. Only took about three or four days. And put it together here with an Anderson lower. I like the aesthetics of the Magpul trigger guard. And up top I've got a UTG super slim 0.83 inch riser with a... Bushnell TRS-25 red dot. Got the super cheap Palmetto State Armory d &H magazine in it. And those have worked great for me. So one in seven twist. And I've also done the super cheap PTAC kits. And also impressive that the upper is not a slick side upper. It does have the forward assist, dust cover, and shell deflector. So, you know, these are the lowest cost bolt carrier groups. But this one looks fine to me. And no issues with these, they function just fine. And you know, they're only 59 bucks separately on their website right now. The charging handle, also, you know, just a cheapo, but it works. So, and that's one of the fun things about this rifle is it's simple, it's clean, it's lightweight, and I'm not going to muck it up with all the aftermarket parts. So, fun to shoot, hitting steel all day long at 50 yards here. And I was using some Federal 556 ammunition and I got a new GoPro Hero 6 I was going to do some slow-mo footage here and <clears throat> because of the fisheye on the lens I have to put it closer than it looks to that steel and I know how the shrapnel spreads out like dust in all directions but my timing on the shots and the targets really low because I have more dirt at the bottom of the backstop there behind the railroad ties but I think you know what's about to happen. Oh, <laughs> GoPro takes one for the team. Luckily, it was just the protective glass over the lens. So got a replacement for that. But, uh, you know, a 16-inch AR-15 is going to be as accurate as you are. So whether it's the Freedom, like on this scope one that I've had, or if it's the Premium. This is my one that's made by FN for Palmetto State Armory. It's their Premium Upper. And I hit basically the same with all of them, you know, and I've shown videos that a red dot is a red dot and, you know, they're just fun rifles. So depending on what your needs are, what your budget is, um, you know, as a backup gun, as a fun gun, this is going to be sort of my YouTube, either a giveaway or a torture test type of rifle. But, you know, fun to have. It's a fun hobby. And I can't say enough good things about the, the kit. It's a great rifle. Thanks as always for watching. Have a great day. Thank you.